Hey, you're the one who's been going around helping people around here, right? The king says to keep up... To your left here is the old Mormon fort. You get roughed up, the followers there will patch you right up. Not that I ever need their services. Up ahead on the next block is where the king's hang out. Don't let them scare you. They don't outnumber you five to one, you'll be fine. I've always liked this quest. Down to the right here is the fun part of town. You haven't seen Freeside till you've been to the Wrangler. He's pointing out all his bullshit. Hey, slow down. I don't like the look of some of those men ahead. Let's There's take like a different three way of us around. too that are heavily armored and armed. We could easily take those guys. <laughs> but anyways, yeah, welcome back, guys, to uh, some more Fallout New Vegas. I'm just making sure my thing goes on there, because you know me, I always have my mic mute for like four hours when I find out. Nothing to worry about. If you had hired one of those up. Uh, noticed that, did you? I keenly <laughs> aimed one of the shots through some soft tissue of one of them to hit the man behind him. That's an interesting theory you've got there. I ought to take my chances and kill you right here. Don't think this is over, though. I'll have that money. Come on, let's get this over with. <laughs> Wait, well, will you actually? Here we are. I trust you. Don't bother me right now. I've got to get back to see if any customers are waiting. Um. So yeah, I gotta do a few things later today, this afternoon, um, so I don't know if I'll be on this afternoon at all. Maybe we'll be back for the evening, but, uh, I thought, you know, I'd hop on though. Dang, that guy was really hungry. Okay. Good. Um, let's say, uh, yeah, so like, I gotta do some stuff this afternoon here. I have to go downtown um, like and look into a few things. Uh, so, but you know, it's the morning, having my cup of coffee. I thought I'd hop on, we'll play for a little bit. What do you have for me? So that's how it happens. Okay, then, I'll have some guys pull him off the street when no one's looking. You've shown me something, so maybe you can help me with a matter that... A lot of folks around these parts who've been here a while resent the sheer number of people that have come into the area since the Strip was built. In turn, the newcomers, most of whom come from the NCR, have gotten ornery from being resented. Sometimes things get violent. This is one of those occasions. Recently, a few friends of mine... Words come that they just woke up over at the old Mormon fort just north of here. Head on over. Good. I like... Things are tense on the strip right now. Oh, those are the the people that we saw yesterday. The named characters in the tent. Okay. We've got stuff we're not even allowed to sell, people. Only at Mick and Ralph. You hear about that band of crazy old ladies running around? I hear they're real vicious when they mug folk. Yeah, I murdered them. 
to death. Hey. Are you What is okay, it? Buddy? Can't you see I want Oh, that's different then. How can I help? They were big guys, young too. No old geezers <laughs> like me. Hell, none of them looked even half my age. I was mostly face down in the dirt, begging for my life when it happened. Well, it happened at night, around 11. We'd recently made some caps off a bit of scrap we found and wanted to invest it wisely. As we were leaving the Wrangler, we must have taken a wrong turn and ended up in the squatter side of town. From out of nowhere, these big guys show up and start barking questions at us, wanted to know if we were locals. The kid there is about as proud as a local around here gets, and started yelling back at him. Then all hell broke loose. Kid got the worst of it, sad to say. Wayne, it's okay. The king sent him. That true? Did the king really send you? I don't really know what else I can add. They were a bunch of guys, better dressed than most freesiders, I guess. That help? Sorry I couldn't help more, especially since you're being so nice. Hey, wait, I just remembered something. I might have heard one of the guys that attacked us call another by name. We had just about had it when one of them said, Hey, Lou, we gotta go. At least I think he said Lou. It might have been something. Now that I think of it, he said Lou something, something with a T. Tenant, that's what he called him, Lieutenant. He probably said Lieutenant, Wayne. The boy means well, but he's dumb as a mutant sometimes. Hello. Hmm. So yes, it was NCR that attacked them. Wowee. I really do want to get the shotgun surgeon perk. So I can ignore so much damage threshold. And I can start shotgun raining everything. Also, I'm having trouble with the the second episode of our Let's Play. For whatever reason, even though I take out, like, like I mute the section of the music, it keeps <laughs> putting another copyright claim on me. Have you found anything of the else? same section? So, like, chat? like, it should have been, like, like, it should have been uploaded, like, two days ago now, but it just keeps getting reclaimed. Bunch of soldier boys, huh? They usually don't come around these parts since their big base is on the other side of the strip. If they're coming over here now, it's got to be for a reason. I if something big is going down, I'm sure rumors of it will have spread. You might also mosey on over to the Mormon fort and chat Julie Farkas up. The followers tend to just don't ask her what to do about it. She'll probably ask you to hug some. Okay. Lots of walking around this episode. You know what? This, ha this happens in this game. For all your shopping needs. Not every single episode can be big, awesome shootout, action-packed adventures. Um, and we really do need to get this XP and kind of uh, grind up our stuff. Hello. Are you here to drop off medical supplies? Rates of injury and illness in Freeside are very high. Supplies don't last long. So yeah, long. Laura Bailey is in this game. Medex, Radaway, and Fixer are Freeside essentials. I can't pay you for any supplies you bring. So far, the Crimson Caravan won't cut us a deal. If you can convince them... You might ask around at Mick and Ralph's, or go see the Garretts, though I suspect they're too busy poisoning Freeside to help it out. Just come... More than rough, it's a damn mess. Freeside townies are constantly picking fights with NCR civilians. Thugs and thieves are always looking for a victim, and the local families are just sitting back making caps on the mess. Freeside is in dire need, but no one has been man enough to step up. The followers can only do so much to stem the tide. 
There is always something needing done. A few souls here in free. We need a regular. The big man around here is the king. Not much. He has the most influence locally, and some of his crew haven't helped the situation by. Some NCR soldiers have been bringing in supplies, but none of it is going to free Cyber. Only a little. A friend of mine, Major Elizabeth Kieran, has been handing out supplies to the poor a little west of here. What about it? I know something's got them riled up, but I've been too busy with other matters to really... If you're looking into the matter, talk to Elizabeth. She's in charge of... If Elizabeth holds out on you, tell her that I sent you. She should be a little more forthcoming if you mention my name. Was... Was that a new quest that I got? No, it wasn't. <laughs> but... You know what? Let's head to Mick and Ralph's, though. And see if we can, uh... Get that, uh... That deal for them. Because having discount services, yeah, like, that's... That's what we want. I don't want to pay fucking three billion caps to heal radiation and stuff like that. Maybe yeah, I got some broken bones, right? Wait, you can't... Can you fast travel with the broken limb? I don't even remember. Hello there. Pimping ain't easy, huh? Maybe if you find some decent talent, I'll start visiting the Wrangler more often. Whoa, what's with the hostilities? We don't have the stills and equipment to supply the amount of meds they're looking to purchase. You could check with other wasteland merchants, but I think your best bet would... They've got a bunch of stills and a seemingly endless supply of grain... Oh. Okay, I thought that you making Ralph would be the more appropriate decision, but... Hey, you're the one who's... Uh, I was gonna say... I was gonna say something. Something stuff. Uh, I thought, like, it'd be the better choice to go with Mick and Ralph, but... No, it seems like... That's the only option. Oh yeah, the implants. I keep forgetting about getting the gosh darn implants. <laughs> That's what I need to do next. Um, That's what I need to do. Uh, I have to decide what type of implant I do want. Hello there. Um, you made a run on the tops, huh? Really now? Well, this is news. We could possibly supply... They have the tech know-how to make our stills work more efficiently. Pure alcohol... Getting our customers drunk quicker means more caps spent at the tables. And plus, the extra alcohol can serve as surgical disinfectant for their needs. The followers are a good lot. They've... Good. We can supply them with all the medex they need. For the fixer, we'll only be able to send over some... Ba We're not in the business of getting people off drugs, so... The followers should be able to whip some up. They just need to agree to fix up our stills and keep them maintained, plus cover the cost for raw materials needed to make the alcohol. That prick Benny had it. What can I get you, friend? Interesting. Well, you're coming. I thought I'd check him. Um.
Where is Mohawk Lady? There she is. Emily says you're working with her on bugging the Lucky 38. That's for... They supply Freeside with drugs and liquor. From my point of view, upgrading their stills would increase their supply of liquor. True, we could help addicts, but the cycle... Good point. We wouldn't be paying anything for their supplies, just a portion of our food waste to make ethanol. We get food from nearby wasteland farmers in exchange for medical services, so we could put our caps back... Tell the Garretts we'll keep their stills running if they provide us with supplies. Yes, old... In Freeside, the drunks and... Okay, now we're going back to the Wrangler. Oh, man. Yeah, lots of back and forth. Lots of back and forth. Chum, welcome. Hey, once our stills are upgraded, we'll never be short on liquor for our patrons. If Jacob Hoff is so... Most might view us as drug-dealing enablers around here. But honestly, we care about our pa We've got enough crime in Freeside without a bunch of strung-out junk... I've got my eye. All right, well, there we go. You got that set up, so that's cheaper service. You seen Dixon around? He said. Julie? Oh, I love Julie. She's such a nice lady. One time I was working on the water pump, and she came over, put her hand on my shoulder, and told me I was doing a great job. <laughs> great job, she says. I just choked up and didn't say nothing. Compliments are so rare these days. Drop drinking? <laughs> I've been drinking for a straight month. Listen, I I've tried to stop, but the withdrawal symptoms are so bad, I feel like... Dixon sells me booze dirt cheap. It does the job, but it tastes like paint thinner, and I feel... I swear that guy's trying to kill me, but what can I do? Take care of the drug dealer, Jesus. Okay. We'll serve some free side justice here soon. What's the pa If you're here to see the major, then I suppose it's all right. Oh yeah, they're in fucking like plain clothes. Here you go. This is sketch. Let's try to keep the line moving, folks. Welcome. There's food and water here for any citizen of the NC. Now I'm a 
afraid we don't. Don't you have a friend you want to bring in? That's not really a pleasant topic of conversation. Let's just say we have our reasons. You know Julie? Not everyone in the NCR sees eye to eye with the followers, but they're okay in my book, mostly because of her. If you really want to know, we sent an envoy to the king, offering to coordinate the relief effort. In a manner of speaking, our envoy was brutally beaten and only barely survived. My superiors ordered the relief mission scrapped. I managed to get clearance to carry out the mission anyway, but with greatly reduced support. Now, there's not enough supplies to go around, even if I wanted to serve the rest of Freeside, which I don't. That's all in the past now. Did you know the strip's all stirred up lately? Okay. Well. Oh, and also, my mic is about to die. Wowee. So that's good to know. So it seems like there's like a third party at play here then. I don't know if I want to inform the king about the NCR can't be on the back there. Then they'll just harass them, right? But... See, our soldier lady told you some wild story about them sending a messenger to us to work out some deal. Oh, yeah, it was Pacer that's, that's beat bullshit. the show. And it's nothing about it a king with. More like they sent some... So do everyone... Yeah, I, just, I totally forgot that, yeah, it was Pacer that was, like, sabotaging and everything. You want someone dead? Really dead? Yeah, they... Those guys are liars. They said they got somebody new, and it's been days now. That could have been a cushy job where I could just be a door greeter. Oh, you really fucked up, didn't you? You really fucked up, didn't you, Pacer? I should just let you die. Truth be told. really a good time like he helped the envoy with then he should watch his back we know for a fact that the envoy made it to their headquarters still 
If the king's willing to deal with us. Evening. Well, these guys really. Did he like try charging their positions too? Wow, they real dumb. Hey, little boy. I want to talk to you. The king just sent a messenger over saying these guys are off limits. Looks like you get to be a hero. Oh, you really fucked up, buddy. You really screwed the pooch, as they say. All right. Wait, can't you? I was just looking at Boone's uh, hunting rifle. Can't you get like a suppressor and stuff like that on it? With a scope and everything and pip it out? I remember using something like that and it was dope. I heard all about what happened. Maybe you've helped us plenty. So I'll tell you what. Just this once, aim whatever you want. And if I can make it happen, it's done. Don't rush it, though. Toss it around in your head a little. There, I can do medium locks, so that's good. Um... Probably do that. Get that to 70. Um... We'll get energy weapons up to... Yeah. I think I might just use... Actually, I kind of want to just look this up and see what people say. Yeah, people say this is pretty much worth it, so you know what? I think I'm going to go with the Shock and Surgeon. Um, ooh, that's actually really good. But apparently also, um, Sneering Imperialist not only has really good... Uh, damage and stuff like that, but you actually do get uh, unique dialogue with it too, which is pretty cool. And I might actually, I think I might get this next for um, for fighting the Legion. But yes, Shock and Surgeon first. Things have been a lot better since you helped with those soldier boys. Uh, I don't want to join the Kings. I just use money. Caps are a little tight these days. 
But with our guards making more and those supplies coming in, I reckon I can spare some. A thousand bottles? Okay. Better since... Near as I can tell, some sort of... Oh, I know it says school out front, but everything in here seems to be related to the worship of some guy from back in the day. People used to come here to learn about him, to dress like him, move like him, to be him. Something like that, yeah. There was some work. Sadly, they stopped working a few years back, so I sold them to a junk. All the outfits you see my guys wearing around were originally found in here, too. Along I got Rex here from a salvager a few years ago. He was a little dinged up when I got him, but one of the followers fixed him right up. He's been acting peculiar for some time now. I took him to the followers and had him checked out, and they said his brain is bad or something. No, they said they don't have the tools to help him. I don't know. Maybe. If you found your best bet will be to talk to Julie Farkas over at the old Mormon fort. No. Pace, he and I grew up together around. Don't judge him too harshly for trying to get some caps out of you. He probably took you for a squatter. There have been a lot of people moving into the... Okay, we have 7,000 caps, dude. I think we might need to buy uh, some implants here. What's up? Uh... So let's hit the gun runners first. We're gonna sell some stuff. Welcome, sir. Or Cause yeah, we get sell that for two hundred, like easy money, easy money. And I'm not gonna lie, dude. I don't think I really need a nine mil SMG anymore. Like, if I got a ten. Wait, what? 154, 20, 135. Yeah, it's like I don't need. I don't need uh, this. So maybe. Let's see if we can find something here. Twelve gauge slug. It's two. Twelve gauge bean bag. I mean, Paul Slug. There we go. We'll do something like that. Boom. Yeah, because people say, like, the getting a slug round, dude, just makes the shotgun obviously like, 10 times better. <clears throat> okay. Now, question is, what type of implants Hello. am I going to get? Wait, where is she? Oh, she's just chilling here.
I just want to see like what they actually do. Okay, so you know what? That Phoenix one's not even that much of a worth it. So if you regenerate one health every 10 seconds. But I'd rather buy the plus four damage threshold, the uh, Neiman subdermal armor. You're back. That would be the Nemian subdermal armor. It's a bit pricey, 8,000 caps, but the implant... It won't make you bulletproof, but it will make you a little harder to injure. Have a seat in the eye. Now it should bring me up to 35, right? I think. I want to say. Yeah, DT 35 now. Hell yeah, dog. You're back. All right, that... All those quests that I just did pretty much took all that money from me. But you know what? That was worth the uh, that was worth the effort because You have chems, buddy? Julie's a saint, but I don't need help. I feel young and strong, as long as I get my chems. You're like gray, and you're losing most of your hair. Why stop? I feel great. No worries, my guy. If I had two caps to scrape together, I'd buy the materials to make my own. But my damn hands won't stop shaking. This guy named Dixon. Something about him seems sketchy, but I can't stop. At this point, I'm mostly buying his stuff just so I don't feel sick. So it seems to be linked back to this Dixon guy. Time to... Wait. Hey, you. Hey, stop running. Looking for a fix, man? Yeah, man. Those cats are out of their domes, addicted to my shit. They can't get enough. Really? You know what? I might be willing... Wait, man. You can't go around saying shit like that. Okay, I get your point. You won't have to worry about me supplying those two anymore. Come on back. So you're back. What? Fine. If you really care so much, then give me some shots. I'm gonna need at least ten shots to get me through the week. From I think you're right. I've been through worse. I'll go to the fort and see if the followers... Yeah. Hey, you're yeah. the one who's been going... Hey, two stim packs. That's actually like a really nice thing. <laughs> Can't go wrong with stim packs. We're about to be done here with all the free side quests anyways. I think. There might be one or two lingering around here, but we got most of it. You know what I was thinking too? Is I kind of want to go and shoot up that NCRF... Uh, NCRCF uh, 
facility with all the power gangers in it. Might be some cheap, uh, some cheap XP, right? Hungry? Thirsty? Horny? The only thing, so I'm gonna say that the one thing that I'm really worried about in this game and dying is grenade traps. Because those grenade traps do like 10 bajillion damage and I'm just trying to bulk up my uh, my damage threshold here so <laughs> I don't get absolutely new. Come on, man, I'm dying here. Oh, Julie, I really screwed things up. I'll head over to... I think we do have some like fixer and stuff like that we could probably donate. I don't really use chem, right? And if I do have an addiction, I could just head here and get it done for a cheap, cheap rice. Which is why we're doing this in the first place, right? To have a cheap doctor to work with. We've got stuff we're not even allowed. Hello. One of my aides said you got into the Lucky 38. If you... Rex? It breaks my heart every time I see him. He's such a good dog. No, Rex's condition is way beyond anything we can handle. He requires brain surgery and some sophisticated cybernetics work, too. There's an old scientist named Dr. Henry, who reportedly specializes in this sort of procedure. He'd probably be your best bet. Last I heard, he was living up in Jacobstown, far to the northwest. Nope. I saw them. Thank you so much for helping them. This means a lot to the followers of the Apollo. If you need some medical supplies, come see me. With Jacob working with us, we should be able to spare a stim or... Sure. You'll need to wait another 24 hours. How much? Thanks. I'm honestly pleasantly surprised they would help us out. But I can see the Garrets aren't doing... Well, it looks like you've earned yourself a discount on supplies now that we'll be fully covered.
Yeah, and this 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 quest scares me um, because I do not want to die <laughs> doing this. Oh, sorry, I didn't mean to hit my mic there. Um, and these are all the. I mean, we could go back to the king and tell him about Rexy. Or, right, you know what, there's no point because he's going to want us to talk to him. Uh, anyways. Oh, yeah, they wanted us to do that. <laughs> But no, yeah, we're gonna fast travel way back over here, and we're gonna go hit that. Uh... All mine. Do I need to sleep or anything like that? Not yet, but... I do need to... But yeah, we're gonna head down to this correctional facility. I think I've only ever done this once where uh like I actually came down to this place. Cause I like just never do. Okay, do I have I mean, these guys should be pretty easy to kill. I'm pretty sure they're like level three enemies. Oh my. Ooh, I leveled up too. Put guns up to 60, because yes, yes. Uh. Mm. You know what? I'm gonna put medicine up to 60. Should put that up. Because. Why do I feel like there was mines here or something? Or am I just crazy? for a few hours. It's been a bit since we last... Yeah, like these guys are still using uh, <laughs> varmint rifles down here. But that's a road. This is the road we don't want to go down. That's where all the deck claws are at.
Oh, those are single shotguns he's using. Okay. Yeah, we're gonna... Can't run from me. Can't run from me. Eight there. My only problem with being here too, though, is that there's going to be lots of explosives thrown around. I don't know if anyone's up in these towers. That's what I'm worried about. <laughs> lots and lots of grenades. I mean, they can just keep coming out here if they want. Wait, am I not hitting like that? Seems like I can't really hit him. Yeah, 
All right, let's see how many fucking. Ah, there we go. I was about to say, there should be a, a key here. Oops, I did not want that. Mm. I'll take the dirty water. Oh, yes, I know I'm so evil stealing from the powder gangers. Hey, where are you going? Didn't know anyone would willingly walk into this place. Not unless they were looking for trouble. What's your story? I was a sheriff, believe it or not. Short version is that sometimes justice is a little slow. That helps. I'm not sorry for anything I did, but I will do the time. Right now, Eddie and his boys run the place. They've got the gun. I understand that Cook was behind it all. I kept my head down. I stuck around, figuring the NCR would show up and put... Some kind of anti-NCR rebel. Some people just don't. He went north with some of the other guys. Didn't say where. Didn't say why. I'm not quite sure the kind of greeting NCR troopers will give an escaped con like myself. I mean, yeah, I guess that's up to you, man. Can you? I don't think you could shoot through that. I think there's an invisible wall right there. It's fine by me. I'll just go up these stairs like this. Oh. Better bing, better boom. Eat this. I think that's one thing that's always bothered me about this game is that yeah, you lose karma from stealing from the uh, the powder gangers. Like really. Some of the worst people out there. I'm gonna lose karma. Okay. Don't worry, you'll go up here and give the old shock. <laughs> Dirty water. Yuck. Oh, what's that though? Three oh shit. That is a lot of three oh Don't I have like a
I even got a... Truth be told, probably too much. Like, 12 gauge is way too strong for these guys. They're not worth the shells. Is there really any point actually to these? Just a bunch of. Oh, I guess there's a little bit of ammo in here. Oh, 100 caps? I'll take that. Cause yeah, like, I don't know, that's a weird thing. <laughs> you're gaining karma for killing people, but then you're losing it for stealing from the bad guys. <sighs> oh yeah, I don't need a varmint rifle. Get that out of here. Play some frag grenades, though. Too heavy for my liking. And there we go. I think we cleared this place out. Perfect. A little bit of XP. Probably not a whole lot, but like. I need what? Yeah, I need 1700 XP to, uh, to level up. Need to talk about something? All right. We'll head back up to the clinic here. I died once, yeah. <laughs> I died once at level 4 it was. But, as you can see, we're doing pretty good right now. Um, DT-35, we got some reinforced combat armor. We got some, uh, some pretty sneaky weapons. So we're not doing too bad for ourselves. Um, there's a couple of things that I'm just a little... 
This boomer part is I'm a little worried about because, uh, yeah, you'll just like straight up die <laughs> if you're not, if you don't do it correctly. So I'm wondering if you could use like a stim pack to, not uh, stim pack, a uh, stealth boy to like just ignore it all. That is... Okay, I did not even get a chance to do that. And that fucked up my arm and leg pretty good. What's this? Oh, I can't even unlock that. There's a bed up here. Yeah, I'm going I think I might kind of want to look that up a little bit low key cuz I do wonder if if you use a stealth boy you're just like safe. Cuz he obviously can't target you, right? But I also have a feeling that because there's a rush development of the game that might not be a thing. Fine by me. I don't know why I haven't hammered, but take it. Twenty gauge, Jesus Christ. Yeah, I don't need that. I believe this is the guy we want to talk to as well. Whoa there, pal. You better slow down, or you'll get blown up like the rest of the idiots who thought they'd scavenge in Muma territory. Now that I've got your attention, might you be in... Whoa, simmer down. I'll tell you, I'm a... I've made some cash from gambling and some cash from reclaiming. Oh, lordy, lordy. You have there are a bunch of artillery slinging, grenade lobbing odd jobs camping out in Nellis. Wander into their territory and you're as good as... There is... Well, I know the secret. If you make it back alive... All right. I suppose I can cut you a deal, but not a cat. Okay, here you go. That page has the details, but it's all in the time. I'll be here watching, so I'll know. Yeah, there's the uh, a train tunnel, eh? Where that would lead to. Um,
I kind of want to say that, like, some people here are saying that the stint, like, the stealth boy actually works. But I'm not entirely sure. Okay, we're going to do this. How much bunny you want to bet that this doesn't actually... work. Yeah, we found out that, in fact, this does not work. Maybe it's because I have other components. I wonder if we're solo. This would work. No, 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 no. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, no. Come on. Ah. Okay, we're good. We Gucci. All right, that's definitely probably the easiest way to do it. <laughs> um. Hold it right there. Don't you move. How the hell did you survive that bump? But I had you zeroed in the whole time. Nobody's... Move a muscle... Then just... Just stay where you are. Raquel will be here any second. I'll take this from here. I'm Raquel, Master at Arms for the Nellis Homeland. Mother Pearl, our eldest, wished... I oversee the security of the Nellis homeland, from the coordination of its defense to the training and fitness of its population. Welcome, child. Took your sweet time getting here, didn't you? I've been waiting a good five years for an outsider to come along and visit. Those howitzers of ours aren't just for entertainment, child. Explosive ordnance is what keeps the savages at a distance. Except you. There's something special about you, child. Oh, so many ways. Small. Should that go well, it may be you can help in big ways, too. 
You have to keep in mind that you're our first contact with the outside world since I was barely a woman. Seclusion has kept us safe, but the world around us is changing. Neon lights in the distance, patrolling robots, soldiers. My youngers think our guns can keep out the world, but I think we need to let it in just a little or become its victim. You're that little bit of the... You picked a good time to stop by, for we're swimming in problems. Raquel could use help with the bug problem. Doc Argyle has wounded he... Or you could just go see Pete at the museum and hear the story. Come and go as you like, help or don't help, I leave it up to you. But I hope you'll show my youngers that not every... Once a Republican, always a Republican. <laughs> what? You should get out. <laughs> okay, I did not expect to hear that. How is your visit with us? Okay. I don't know why it's telling me I'm in the field shack right now. I can take care of that robot problem for you. Just saying. Just give me one second here, guys. I just realized that my computer sounded like it was going to blow up here, so I'm just going to restart that, and I'm going to go use the washroom anyway, so I'll be back in just a couple minutes.
Sorry about that, you guys. Something came up there, but I am back. Um, just gotta reboot all my stuff here because it's all messed up. Jesus. All the pop ups in Z World. Get rid of that. Bring up Twitch again here because I am flying blind at the moment, so. Sorry if I don't see your stuff. Gotta give me a minute. Give me a minute. I know Mother Pearl is letting you wander Nellis as you please, outsider. I have three patients here who were gravely injured fighting those giant. I've stabilized their wounds, but they're. If what you say is true, you can do us a world of good. Alrighty, I am back. That was some fine doctoring. I could learn a thing or two from you. What is my medicine? Medicine 60, right? Yeah. I thought that man was done for. But you brought him around. Yes, outsider? Those men owe you their lives. Seems we could learn a thing or two from you savages, when it comes to medicine at least. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Kind of extreme. You're all savages. Yeah. Wait, that's the school, right? Girl, where you going? I need your quest. Mother Pearl's instructions are clear. You can move freely or these are extraordinary. Long story short, the power failed a few days ago because giant ants have tunneled into the. I led a team down to exterminate them. But personally, I think it's more than a savage can handle. But if you want to kill those. Sure, anyone can, but there's more than a few. But one other thing, the ants must be. They exploded when hit by a flamethrower. One of us was using a laser pistol. Loyal's been working on some kind of weapon to use it. Dang, look at that. That strong chin, man. Whew. Let's go kill us, uh... So mates. Oh, wait, we got another patient. I'm feeling pretty good about this character, you guys. Like, this is crazy. This is our only second attempt right now. And uh, we're level 15. We got some implants, we got some good shit. Uh, apparently we cannot use uh what's it called? Wait, I have a lever action shotgun. Don't know when I got that. Okay. Um, but yeah, we got some good stuff here. Like, I feel like we just keep playing smart. Don't do anything stupid. We could have this in the bag, our second attempt. A50. You caught me right at the end of the stream, my man. About to go break for... Uh... Go break for... For lunch here pretty soon. We're going to clear out this ants, though, first, before I do that. Shotgun rain, baby. 
Shotgun rain, baby. Oh, fuck. Okay, you... You need to stay here. Because you're gonna... <laughs> you're gonna blow us up. <laughs> if I let you in there. Grenade launcher. Ooh, ooh. I'll take that. All right. Yeah, I gotta do a little bit of uh. Oh my god, that's actually really good. We'll definitely keep that. Got to do a little running around too here after lunch, but we'll be back later. Um, but it's not quite over yet. Just gonna clear out these ants that are chilling here. So I can't seem to see them. Where are they? Big bugs, easy bugs. A little bit of shock and rain won't stop them. Ooh. I will take all your rounds though. 44 mag. Missiles, mini nuke. Oh my, Atlanta, look at all this stuff. Oh God, so much ammo. I needs it though. Oh my, dude. Okay, I have like. <coughs> I was not expecting this much fucking ammo. <laughs> wow. Okay, that is. Who we? That is like 28 pounds of freaking ammo. Okay, we're gonna get rid of. What that's like what? 360. Don't need that. Boone! Boone, where are you? Actually, you know what? I should probably be using my uh, hunting oh rifle. My. Can't run from me. I only use my 20 gauge, because, or my 12 gauge, sorry, because uh, I think that's a little too strong uh, Fine by me. for what I currently have. Wait, what does my thing use here? It uses 40 mil. Oh, you know what? The uh, the 25 is for the uh, the grenade launcher, like the the repeating one. Um. I don't need to quite have that on me right now. Oh my god. I didn't realize I had 17 pounds of <laughs> Sunset Sarsaparilla on me. There. That'll work for now. Eat this.
Oh shit. Okay, maybe actually I need to take out the hunting shotgun because Oh, I need to flip this switch. There we go. Oh shit. Oh no, there's actually ants right over there. Perfect. Little bit of shotgun rain never uh, failed to do it's a thing. Boo! I don't know what I'm trying to say. Shotgun rain never fails me. There you go. Boom. All right, Eddie. I know you were kind of up here doing your own thing. I hope you're all right. <laughs> I heard a couple explosions up here. Um, you know what? We're gonna put on the tri beam laser rifle. This thing was kind of the goat, too. God, so it. This is a pretty big base. I mean, it makes sense. It's an air base, but like, I think dog it takes a while to uh to get around here. That's probably like my biggest complaint with this location is that because you're gonna be doing lots of running back and forth, and yeah, there's one I think. Uh, you know, maybe no, so. The hangers, yeah. So, like, anywhere between here, you have to run a considerable distance. <laughs> but, it would. It would have been a lot worse if I still had that metal armor where I walked at fucking, like, speed of two. Kind of want to get that, uh, you know what? Maybe I will buy I that. I can take care of that robot. The agility. For you. Just saying. I see uh, the power's back on. The ants are all dead. So I could run a little faster, eh? Maybe Pearl is right about you. Because I don't know how you pulled that off. I'll tell Loyal to send someone down to clear Shotgun, out the maybe. eggs and repair the generators. Good work. Um... Uh. Wait, there's another person here? What is it, Outsider? The next time you leave Nellis, keep an eye out for missiles. We're down to a five-year supply for our launchers. Yeah, I don't have missiles to, like, just give you. 
<laughs> um. Yeah. I think we're going to. Once a Republican, always a Republican. I hope Pearl knows what she's doing, letting you... If that's so, how about you look into... Re Nothing too complicated about it, but it's a long way... You can't miss the array. It's on... Ha! Huh. If we had spare parts, do you think I'd... No, we ran out of spares a while back. And there have to be spare parts somewhere around the wasteland. But I just don't know where to direct. Yep. Let's see what. Yeah, right here. Okay, and then yeah, there's this kid. Alrighty, so yeah, I'm gonna end the stream there. Uh, I'm gonna go break for lunch. I'm gonna. Go do a few things, check into some stuff, but uh, when we come back, we'll continue on with the with the boomer side quest. Because yeah, we have to get these guys support for Mr. House, right? Um, I wonder if I can, because like my repair is pretty high, right? Yeah, like it's okay, it's not super high, but it's fifty. Uh, so I wonder if. Uh, if I can do it then. But, um, yeah. Anywho. I'll see you guys at some point today, I imagine. But, uh, I just don't know when, alright? See you guys on the next one. Peace out!